Hi, I, I've been uh, trying to figure out for the past 20 years how to mow this steep hill um, without uh, killing myself. And uh, part of the solution was to get this battery-powered self-propelled lawnmower, but even, even then it kept sliding off the hill and I would have to have a second person hold me onto the hill with a rope or hold the mower onto the hill with a rope while I guided it back and forth. And today I think I finally uh, figured out how to do it without the rope in the second person. So uh, come up here and I'll, I'll show you what I did. Um, Basically, I was just thinking of studded tires and, you know, pleated shoes that golfers and football players and baseball players wear. And uh, I just went and got my electric drill and a bunch of fistful of uh, cheap metal screws. And I studded the rear wheels. So I, I put a screw in every six inches or so, going all the way around the wheel. Uh, and did the same thing on the other side. On the front wheels, I didn't do it so that I can still transport it on pavement by lifting up the rear wheels, and I just scoot it along like that. This would roll very well on pavement, but on any grass, they just sink right in, and the traction's incredible, uh, and it's probably helping to aerate the lawn too. So here we go with the demonstration. I've already mowed the steepest part, so pretend this wasn't mowed yet, and I'll do, uh, oh, there's a skip there. I can do that. That'll be useful. Okay. Here I go. When I need to go on pavement, I reset the handle angle so that it's easy to lift up the rear wheels. And then I can just uh, travel on the front wheels across the pavement. Like that. And over here I'll show you how I put the studs in. Here are the uh, sheet metal screws. And... Here we go. How am I going to hold the camera and put in a sheet metal screw? I guess in my mouth. Okay, I'm going to hurt you I hope I don't rule on that. Okay, putting in a sheet metal screw. Just like that. There are three quarter inch sheet metal screws, and I just put them in about a quarter of an inch. <laughs> 